This is a proposal for improving the display of bendy bones or B bones in Blender. In Blender, we can display bones in a couple of different ways, but the most commonly used ones are octahedral and B bone. Octahedral has the advantage that it clearly shows the direction of the bone, the head and the tail. But riggers often switch the display mode to B bone while creating rigs. Uh, and that is obviously great if you're using bendy bones because this is the only mode that allows you to see the bendy bones uh, segments. But also riggers use B bone display even if there are no segments because of the display size property. So if you have overlapping bones, you can just press Ctrl, Alt, and S and change the thickness of a B bone. So that can help see overlapping bones. Also, by changing the thickness of a bone, you can indicate its function. And this makes B-bone display really great when creating rigs. But unfortunately, you cannot see the direction of the bones like in octahedral mode. So from time to time, you may have to switch to octahedral, which is fine. But I think it would be nice if we just had an indication of direction in B-bone mode. So I imagine that we could have another uh, slider here which is called something like tail display size, and it will allow us to taper the bone a little bit towards the tail. And that could make B-bones the ultimate display type for rigging. So this is just a cube, but if we imagine that it is a B-bone, then the setting that I propose will just taper the B-bone like this. And if the B-bone has B-bone segments, then it could look something like this. Or alternatively, I guess we could have something more like this. So um, if we imagine that these are B-bone segments, then each B-bone segment could be tapered. Recently, Blender artist Philo Vivero released a video showing an implementation of this exact idea. And he has already shared the code tweaks that he did to make this happen. So this is already possible, but it requires you to apply a patch and build Blender yourself, which most people don't do. But if we can get the Blender developers on board, maybe we'll see tapered bendy bones in an official Blender release in the future. That's it. If you like the idea, please support it on right-click select. And I'll share a link to the proposal. Thanks.